What's up, YouTube? Bamboo55 here, coming at you with another Pokemon video. This one is uh, episode six, I believe. Yeah, I'm yeah, episode six of Pokemon Glazed Let's Play. You know, it's pretty good. And uh, in this episode, we are going to be taking on uh, the second gym, second gym battle, gym or battle. God, I can't talk right now. It's like midnight. Or whatever. Needed to record some glaze, you know. Um, so yeah, um, let's do a quick party update. Inferno Star, level 27. Um, Mock Punch, Flame Wheel, Leaf Blade, you know. Viney Fuck, level 19. Buzz Kid, level 24. Pretty impressive. Uh, got Thunderbolt. Hits pretty hard. And we've got Eevee here, which doesn't have any good moves, but. It'd be nice to uh, maybe give it the EXP share and train it or something. Cause I'm uh, hoping I might. I'm trying, hoping to get an SPM later. But the problem is, is that I always record glazed at night. And if this has a clock, then it would always evolve into Umbreon. So then I have to change the clock or something. I don't know. I'll figure it out if I really need an SPM. I mean, it'd be helpful against Team Fusion, but. Whatever, and Milkshake level 31, and we caught a Ghastly named Nappy, uh, just level 16, just to have, you know, we could use it as Death Fodder, or something like that, and whatever. So, yeah, let's get going to the gym, um, I don't know what type it is, uh, it looks like it's Rock or Ground. Hello, Ben55, Terry's back, as you can see. Terry uses Ground type Pokemon, so use Water type Pokemon to get an edge. As if Marshtomp wasn't already overpowered enough. Should I use Viney Fuck instead? But I don't really like Viney Fuck. He's like level 19 and I don't really think he's going to stay on my team. So I guess we're going to use Milkshake this one. Buzz Kid. We're going to take the XP share off of him. And give it to Eevee. Just so Eevee can, can uh, start leveling up. Hopefully learn an attacking move. Alright, well, it looks like we've got a series of ladders and stuff, but uh, let's just get into the first battle. Alright, well that guy's pretty easy. <clears throat> Alright, looks like we've got either the top hole or the bottom hole. I'm gonna go with the top hole, just cause I'm feeling it. And, oh yeah, this reminds me of the fire gym in Emerald. Alright, looks like we've got this old guy we gotta battle. That guy was a piece of cake. Let's uh, keep going. Oh, shit. We went the wrong way. Well, we got more experience. Oh, shit. I went the wrong way again. Oh, my God. I'm, I'm dumb. Gym badges or gyms are not my strong suit. Just kidding. They're not that hard. I don't know why. I just fucked that up. All right. I, I have a feeling... We go up here. And let's battle this guy. Alright, I have a feeling we're going the right way. Oh, there's the gym leader. Um, yeah, well, there's another trainer battle right here, so we might as well just do it. 
cause extra experience and whatnot for EV. I think that's that might be all the trainers there might be one more but it's okay we don't need to go all the way back I uh, maybe I should have gotten some potions before this battle actually yeah we got we're gonna have to head back because uh, I, I'm gonna need to go to the Pokemart and uh, buy some supplies because I the only potion I have is a po is just one potion you know uh, because at Haunted Rock we had to use a lot of potions to win you know it was kind of hard but we do have almost 10k which is pretty nice it's pretty clean um let's get seven soup potions that's already half our money shit um two revives. Shit, I don't know what else to spend this on. And one hyper potion. And an awakening. Just cause last time I was sleeping and that was bad. Paralyzed heal, why not? An antidote. Always gotta be prepared. And we'll save the rest. And this has been what you need to buy with bear potion. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I feel like I have a mumbling problem sometimes. I, sh I can fix that, hopefully. Alright, well, yeah, we're going to heal up right here. <coughs> and we're going to take on the gym leader. Hopefully, a level 31 Marshchomp is going to be able to beat him, even though I only have Water Gun. Water Gun's not very powerful. Uh, so we'll see how that works out. But, um, I do have a lot of other Pokemon, and even though they're ground type, I still should be able to, to win. I'm not, but then again, this is Pokemon Glaze, anything can happen, really. And, I mean, we should be prepared for anything. He could just pull out, let's see, ground type? I don't know, I can't think of any, watch him have, like, a Golem. Like, a level, level 100 Golem. Alright, Gligar? Alright, Gligar's not that good. Um... Oh, I'm almost level 32. Water gun? Fuck. Why you gotta use protect? Um, I'm thinking water gun will do hopefully, hopefully half, maybe. And we'll see about that. And he's gonna toxic me, which is kind of unfortunate, because that's gonna be continuous damage on, like, the one guy who can actually do damage to his team. Um, I'm actually gonna predict his protect here. And go for an antidote. Making plays, making plays, let's see. Oh dang! Making plays, making plays. Money. <laughs> and now he just goes for protect again. I don't understand why. Like, what? I'm not poisoned. Okay, now I'm poisoned. But whatever. Alright, we need to we need to crit on this water gun right now, or else we're gonna have to like use another antidote and shit like that. And this is gonna start pissing me off. So just please go. Right. Oh my fucking god. Alright, I'm gonna predict the protect again. And cure him. Good thing I got another antidote, I guess. Oh my god. This is annoying. Do I have like an X special attack? Doesn't look like it. No. We're just get, we're gonna bank on a like a, a crit, dude, and just do massive damage. <clears throat> I'm thinking another water gun might be able to kill. All right, can you stop poisoning me? This is fucking stupid. The I'm get, the gym battles in this game are probably like they probably just get even even worse. I mean, I think this is intense. It's gonna get way worse. Dang, predicting that protect again, boy. You know me. Alright, water gun. 
Stop protecting, you're fucking gay. Honestly. That just reminded me, at school today, they were talking about how it's not right to call things gay. I'll call, I'll call shit gay if I want to call it gay. Fuck you. Alright, there we go. And Eevee level 22. Hopefully you learn a move soon. But not today. Pupitar. Oh my... Pupitar is ground type? Really? I thought it was rock and dark. I know Tyranitar is rock and dark. Maybe it's different for... Pup Maybe I think Pupitar is ground and dark. And then all of a sudden Tyranitar is rock and dark. Oh, that did a lot. Yeah, I probably should have healed there too. Um. Well, we'll hope for... Oh my god! Oh my... Ladies and gentlemen. Alright, kill this pupitar finally. What's the last Pokemon? What's the last Pokemon? I'm scared. Don fan? Um, alright, that's okay. Here, we're gonna switch into Nappy. And, um... Take this advantage... Take this... Uh, why did I say advantage? Take this opportunity to heal up Marsh Tomp so that when he comes in, he uh, is strong and bulky. And that Donphan's level 33. That's higher than Marsh Tomp. We've been training Marsh Tomp like crazy. Oh my god, roll out? That's gonna like do a lot to, to Marsh Tomp if it keeps racking up. So, that's not good. I mean, Last Resort... We could probably spore him and shit like that. But I don't want to use Viney Fuck in this battle. Because Milkshake can do it. Oh, that was a critical hit. Damn. Roll. Oh my god, this is bad. Rollout's not effective. I don't care. What does he got? Citrus Berry? No. No, 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 no. Okay. Wait, leftovers? Since when did gym leaders get leftovers? Dang, uh, whoever made this game really, like, made it hard. Because, like, come on, leftovers? That That's kind of crazy. Please kill, please kill, please kill, please kill, please kill. There we go, there we go. We just, we just got a second gym badge. That's right, second gym badge, bitches. Leader Terry is defeated. You did splendidly. This badge is rightfully earned by you. Dang, we got 3,300 for winning. That's that's pretty good. <laughs> the dirt badge, really? Oh, I bet it's so shiny. Alright, level 30, obey you, whatever. Take this TM. 26, what was that? Earth please be Earthquake. I think it's Earthquake. Oh shit! Oh shit, Earthquake! Marsh Tom's learning Earthquake. Marsh Tom's learning Earthquake. Oh shit. Oh, shit, shit, shit. Alright, officer. Sorry, I didn't mean to alarm you. Blake just notified our office that you were responsible for running off Team Fusion at the Haunted Rock. We wanted to thank you with this. Obtain the room key. Oh, that's for, uh, for, uh, Fusion Resort, right? Room 203 of the Fusion Resort. It's yours for the year. You should check it out because it costs a fortune. Thanks for upholding the law, kid. Alright, well, we are gonna go do that. Thanks for the info, pal. What's in room... <coughs> What's in room 203 at the ever-so-expensive Fusion Resort? Dude, I'm sorry. Marsh Tomp is really strong. Level 32. He's gonna be a Swampert soon. He's got Earthquake. We need a stronger water move is what we need. Um, because we have Mudshot. But... Earthquake is really powerful. Um, and yeah, I'd really like to get an Espeon. But we gotta improve happiness, and we actually have to battle with it, and I'm not gonna battle with it unless it has an attacking move. Alright, room 203. Probably on the second floor. <laughs> Alright. Alright, let's go, let's go. Oh, I just, I'm antsy. I wanna see what's in there. Room 203 right here. Look at that, I'm so smart. What's in here? What's in here? Oh, I'm blind. There's a Pokeball. Sea Spray Ticks. Yes! Oh, that's to get to Sea Spray Town. Remember how we were looking at the map? 
And uh, we could, I couldn't figure out how on earth we were going to get to Sea Spray Town because we didn't have Surf. And we would have to go like all the way around. Alright, well that is our ticket to Sea, Sur sea Spray Town. So it looks like this game is, uh, there's a lot of water in this game, and so it's really dependent on getting places by going by boat. Um, which they, they have, like, uh, the SS Anne and, like, cruise ships in, like, every Pokemon game, or a lot of them. But in this one, they actually center on it. It kind of reminds me of Hoenn. There's a ton of water. There's a ton of water in Hoenn. Alright, is this, uh, is this it? Ahoy, would you like to travel to Sea, Sa sea Spray Town? Hell yeah, I mean, that's where we're, we gotta go next. Sea Spray Town. Oh my god. Wait, just just pause and look at this. Not pause. Um, This is exactly like Pokemon XD Gale of Darkness. Gale of Darkness, if you've played it. There's a, a town in the port the port city. Look at it. There's a, there's like a lighthouse looking thing right there. And like, this looks exactly like it. Exactly like it. Alright. Oh, here's that chick with the cynical. Bad 55, what a shock to see you here. I see you beat Sparky and Terry too. They were easy wins for me. That's because you're grass, and electric doesn't hurt your grass, and you're super effective, so fuck you. My bay leaf took them down with ease. Don't believe me? Come on, let's battle. Alright, well, that's not very good for me because Marsh Tomp is in front, so we're probably going to have to switch into Inferno Star. Or something like that. Level 30. See, like, <laughs> I thought level 32 was high, but, um, really, all my guys are under leveled except for Milkshake. So yeah, we're we're gonna like have to do lots of grinding throughout this entire let's play if we're gonna need to stay strong in the, in this let's play because it's hard. Like it's it's a hard game and the levels are high and and shit. Literally, like doing a nuzlocke would be like I I'd like to see someone win. They'd have to be good at nuzlocks because this is just insane. Oh my fucking god! <laughs> No, no, no! Oh my God! Not is is he gonna live with one HP again? Come on, come on! All right, there we go, there we go. Inferno Star level twenty eight. Let's go, right? Wait, did did he not level up? Okay, Eevee's learning Quick Attack. That is good, cause now we can I can at least go grind with him off screen <coughs> or something. To try to get him, you know, to uh, happiness up and higher level and become an Espeon. Level 28, there we go! <laughs> Alright, you. Yeah, we're gonna go back into Milkshake. Eevee's level 23, hopefully he gets higher. We're gonna probably have to train Buzzkit again soon. Because I would like an Electabuzz. Oh, I didn't teach him Earthquake! If Mudshot doesn't kill, I'm gonna be fucking pissed. Let's go. Fuck! Earthquake would've killed. Earthquake would've killed. For sure. Just just calling it right now. Uh, actually, we could probably teach Earthquake to another person. Now, fuck that. It's Stab for Milkshake. Why would I not teach it to him? Unless Eevee can learn Earthquake. Then just, that would wreck. Alright. Well, we just destroyed her. Hmm. You think you're clever, but my Pokemon were just weak from my gym battle. They look like they had full health to me, bitch. Speaking of which, the gym leader left shortly after our match. If you plan on challenging her, you better go find her. In any case, I'm off to Stor Stormy City for my fourth gym badge. Be seeing you. Stormy City? That's probably a water thing. Oh, no. Not again. What's happening? Ah! What's happening? Newport Richie. What the hell? Where the hell am I? Um, hi? Where, where am I, bro? Mumble grumble. Where are my keys? Holy shit! Ban 55, you scared me. Please don't do that again. I suppose you're here for answers, right? Hmm. You've been an excellent help to me, so I owe you an explanation. It's the least I can do. Our universes were never meant to be connected, but a great force is bringing them much too close. I don't know what's causing it, but I have a hunch it's a legendary Pokemon from your world. But it doesn't make sense. Just like you, I'm able to slip between our universes. I've even managed to gain control of it, as I showed you the first time you arrived. I've taken it upon myself to figure out what's going on, and to stop it before dire things happen. The people here don't know of Pokemon. If they were found, I can't let that happen. 
Can I trust you with a great task? I can't keep tab on what happens in your role, your world. Oh yeah, you can't keep tabs even though you got control of it and you can just go there whenever you want. Yeah, sure. Please report to me any news of humans or Pokemon that may be cause of maybe the, the cause of universe. Ugh, maybe the cause of our universe is merging. I realize you'll want to return home. The portal to your world has been shut, but it's most likely able to be reopened. Look around where you arrived. You might be able to find a way back. Um. Nope. I don't. Um. So yeah. Basically, our our universes are merging or something. And so I guess I'm traveling between it. That's kind of cool. What about when they attack you? Attack me? What on earth are you talking about? I saw you talking with Luke. Are you guys friends? He, he's the one only make fun of me for liking the Pokemon games. He says he's a Poke fan, just like me. Are you a Poke fan too? You are? Oh wow. Thanks for cheering me up. A world without Pokemon. It must be awful to not have the feeling of love that only a Pokemon can give. That girl, she shouldn't be treated like an outsider because she cherishes that. Whoa! Alright, so I'm supposed to report back to Luke when there's bad things happening, but I can't control where I go, so I don't see how I'm supposed to do that. So, fuck you, Luke. You can go suck a dick. And, yeah. Alright, our guys are all healed up. Nice and, nice and bulky as fuck. <laughs> I wonder what the uh, Sea Spray Town Gym is. I feel like it should be water. Sea Spray Town seems like a water gym. Oh, here's the gym leader, I think. My Oh, my mom, the gym leader, sorry, just went on important business. Something about the Sea Spray Dam. Alright, well, we're in a new town, so we gotta talk to everybody. A Pokemon trainer by the name of Sohil lives on an island just outside of town. I hear that he's an excellent battler, but he really doesn't like people. You don't like people, fuck you. <laughs> Move relearner. Ooh. I don't have any hard scales, so I'm not gonna go there. Whoa, there's a giant mark there. Where does this go? So heal straight. Oh, Pokeball. Dire hit. Alright, so I guess if we get surf, we can go up there and meet this so heal guy. And they'll probably give us something. Hello, little girl. Whee! Alright, what do you guys say? Rumor is that Sea Spray Town is one of the most relaxing towns to live in. I must say I agree. Everyone talks about how great their town is. Fuck you. Humans aren't the only ones who like good food. Pokemon are just as happy to eat delicious food as we are. Yeah, figured. My husband offered to make dinner for me. Isn't that sweet? Who cares? <laughs> these, town these houses are all the same. Electric types tend to be very fast, while rock types tend to be very slow. Don't tell me what I already know. I bet you can't catch me. I bet I can't because you're not even moving. Oh my god. What are you doing? Movies can be an excellent source of knowledge. For instance, I never knew that many legendary Pokemon had the ability pressure. And you learned that from a movie. Congratulations. <laughs> it's so boring here. Yeah. I, I feel you, bro. There's nothing to do here. Some Pokemon might get burned. Okay, I get it. No. No. Bye. Alright, we did all those houses, and that house, and the Pokemon Center, and there's no houses up here. What's, what do you guys say? You'd think I'd get enough of the ocean on a normal day, but I still love to stroll along the shore. What do you guys say to bitch? Fuck you, talk to me. The, bi the bitch here is absolutely tiny, I wish you could go to Serenity Isle and soak in the rays there. Alright, let's see what the... Sea Spray Dam... To the oh, Caesar Town, Gemini Village down. Oh, oh, shit! Double battle. I caught myself there. That was that was fucking close. Oh dang! I could pull an earthquake levitate shit if I really wanted to right now. But why would I do that? I'm still gonna teach earthquake to uh, motherfucking milkshake. We're gonna delete mud slap. Because even though it lowers accuracy, that's not that good anymore. Wow, Mud Shop only does 55. And Earthquake does 100. So, we're going to be wrecking kids. Um, yeah, let's put Eevee. Um, 
in our slot. Because he's got quick attack, and even so, he's got supporting moves. So yeah, let's just battle him. Hey, that girl's cute. Let me win so I can impress her. Hey, do you like visiting the Sea Spray Dam too? Alright, well that was a pretty good battle. Double battle anyway. Um, yeah, it looks like we're at the Sea Spray Dam here. Um, I think this is a good place to end the episode. Um, yeah, so we did a lot this episode. We beat the gym badge, or we beat the gym leader, Terry, the sec and got our second gym badge. We traveled to Sea Spray Town, and we're gonna take on the Sea Spray Dam next episode. So, um, I hope you enjoyed the, uh, I hope you enjoyed the episode. And uh, also, just letting you guys, uh, giving you guys a heads up, is that uh, I'm starting to, I'm going to do a collaboration with a few guys um, that I just met on Twitter, and we've been Skyping and stuff, and uh, I'm going to be doing a tag lock of the Pokemon Leaf Green and Fire Red. It's going to be like a versus, and we're going to like switch off, so it's going to be kind of like a tag team versus tag lock Nuzlocke variant. And uh, I think it's going to be really cool. And so we're going to get everything prepared um, on Monday. And so we'll see when I'm going to be swapped in. And I'll post my video, the ones that I'm in, and give you links to the other ones so you guys can watch that. And that'll be uh, good times. And it's uh, my chance that I can do a Nuzlocke because, uh, you know, I've been saying that I want to do Nuzlocke because I haven't done one before. And yeah. So anyway, hope you enjoyed the episode. Uh, if you liked it, please leave a like rating. It really helps me out and uh, it makes gives me motivation to make more videos. Check me out on Twitter, and if you haven't already, please subscribe and keep watching some videos. So, yeah. Later, guys. Peace.